What's good, everybody? It's Kuro Necro here for the Kuro Necro Network, and we're back with another Pokemon comparison video. This time, we'll be looking at the group Girls Girls, and yes, that includes Ron Ishii because she was initially a member of the group when I first did these, and I know you guys probably want to know who Ron is. But first, before we get started, go ahead and click that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed, and ring the notification bell so YouTube can actually show you the videos when more of these come out. But let's hop right into it. We're going to start things off with Ron because why not? Because, first of all, I think it's pretty obvious who is going to be anyone who knows me. If you're on this channel, you see me refer to her as Diamond, 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 Diamond. You know exactly what Pokemon she is, right? If you guess Diancy, congrats. You've actually paid attention, and yeah, that's a no-brainer. Next up, we have Yuzu, and my reason for picking her is... Um, well, Yuzu's Victini because Victini is like the first Pokemon according to the canon of the game, being number zero in the Pokedex. And Yuzu was the first member of Girls Girls before they were even called Girls Girls. So Yuzu, Victini, also she actually kind of looks like Victini to me. Next up on the list, we have Kira. And Kira, well, the first thing that comes to my mind with her is long flowy hair, just really beautiful, elegant, just how she carries herself. And so the only Pokemon that comes to mind is Pheromosa. Yes, it's an Ultra Beast, but yeah, that just that level of elegance and beauty is the first thing that comes to mind when I think Kira. Just unfortunately, it's also a cockroach. Next up, we have Minami. And Minami being the baby of the group, I can't help but pick a baby Pokemon for her. So, well, the first baby Pokemon that comes to mind is something that's like small but powerful and has a big presence. So, she's Tinkertuff. I know it's a kind of newer one, and some people might not be familiar with it, but it's actually one of my favorites of the newer ones, and Minami is one of my favorite members, so call it a bias. Next up is Yoka, and Yoka's always giving me a bit of a bunny-like vibe, so she's La Bunny. Also, La Bunny is one of the Pokemon that people think is hot, and if we can't agree that Yoka's one of the hot ones in the group, um, why are you here? All right, next up we have Kraya, Smeargle. No, no, I'm not giving an explanation. I don't know why, just when I think Kraya, I think Smeargle. Next up is Misaki, and look, this is the part of the video where people are either gonna drop off, unsubscribe from me, or have a thousand and eight comments, but look, I've said it a thousand times. It's on the video that I did about Misaki. Misaki is the sexy member in the group. She just is. And you know what Pokemon, if you're on the internet, that people consider the sexy Pokemon. So she's Gardevoir. Do with that what you will. Misaki is Gardevoir. All right, next up we have Momo. And it, it might not match her personality as much, but when I think of Momo, I just think she looks long. Not tall, but she just looks long. She just looks long limbs i guess or just she looks long and beautiful so momo is milotic the long beautiful pokemon saving the best for last toa is carnivine no 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 seriously i'm joking i'm joking she's not carnivine toa clearly would have to be some kind of squirrel and the first squirrel that comes to mind is probably pachirisu but no emoga look at emoga and tell me that's not toa it even has a toa chan smile that is toa like if you if you disagree with this one, I don't understand. The other ones, maybe I can understand. But this one, Emolga, Toa, perfect match. And there we have it. Every member of Girls Girls plus Ron Ishii as a Pokemon. Do you like these picks? Do you not like these picks? Would you have chose others? Let's get a discussion going in the comment section below. Until next time, this is Curl Neckle Nair for the Curl Neckle Network. Telling you all to be you, be true, be human. Catch you on the next video. Bibito Kata!